Well, it's all right. We, we, we'd like to have confusion in the show. Uh, yeah. All these people will that ask who you are and yeah. what you're doing and why. And so. Have the kennel dogs been fed? Yes, all the dogs were fed inside. We've been a little busy. Um, do you have problems with the larger names trying to take food off the counter? I don't particularly have a problem with the dogs Thank taking you things. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Off the counters. Uh, we teach them at a very young age. That's a no zone. Uh, we make that very, very clear. So that's usually not an issue. still in there, I think. Um... Thank you for feeding the poke. You're welcome. We moved the pokies down to the barn so you guys could see them a little bit more. Um, I'll try and take a few through the arena every day. They'll definitely be fed on camera in the morning. Um, who is filming you in the arena on the stairs? I'm not at liberty that to discuss is, who is filming is me today. Uh, you guys will all find out soon. The dog I was training was Dwyer or Dryer, whatever you want to call him. Um, that was his first time doing the one step on the stairs before we just go up and down. So they made us do it like 10 times so that he did really, really well. I don't know if you watched it at all. I, I, some of it. I yeah, it was his first time doing the one step down and up the stairs. He did really well. Yeah, that in the book is um, exactly right. Yep, my guests tonight are Katie and Devin. So any questions for them is awesome, is awesome too. <laughs> my favorite part of training is the moment that the dogs it finally clicks with the dog and they understand um like carlene says that moment in the helen keller with the water so that's definitely my favorite moment um let's see which pups were star today in training dwyer or dryer whatever he was definitely um number one today he did really really well let's see my number one is Orville was number one for Katie, and what about you, Devin? How was Sophia today? Sophia was very good. She was very good today. Good. good. Did you take Sophia with you on your modeling? Do she you ever use loud, unexpecting that, sounds when training? Yes, I do. Um, I don't do she loud sounds in the arena, but I do a lot of that um, at Cranny Storage. They have this indoor storage unit with these big, loud metal doors, and I walk through and I slam against the doors, so that startles the dogs. Hi. Hi. So, that works really well. Um, who's the biggest pokey? I'd say Lint Ball. Ball of Lint is definitely the biggest pokey. Um, let's see. Anything else? Anything else? Sound is on. Merle and Gronk are playing in Kennel 10. Look at them all. Well, look at Gronk and Merle playing in the arena. They were playing? Yeah, thank you. Uh, let's see. Any other questions? A few more minutes. Anything for Katie or for Devin? I'll be here tomorrow. They can ask me. Oh, they can ask you something now if they want to. <laughs> that dog is deaf. Let's she's see. Waiting for her owner to come back in. What else she's exciting deaf. do we have going on today? Anything? Normal puppy stuff? Yeah. Yellow's here for the weekend. You'll be able to see him in Walter's kennel. So maybe the cam will point over there for you guys. To watch him cry instead of Walter. <laughs> <laughs> they both have their just own way of crying. Just changing it up a little. Yeah, just switching up the stud. Um, Walter cries a lot more. Yellow just does this little whimper. I'll try and get a video of it. He's he has really not been cute. neutered yet, has he? No. Denise doesn't want to because she talked. She said the only way she was going to do it is if it stops his salivating. Oh, and they said that it's not going to. So she said it, they don't bother her. So she's just going to keep him intact. And I don't think it'd be a terrible thing. So, I mean, he did actually tie once with Noel, and they did. Yeah. Have he's a, a pretty but, dog. Yeah. He's a nice dog. And he's so sweet. He's just, yeah. The only, he just needs to work on his recall. That's about well, it. That's but, no problem. Yeah. <laughs> so, any suggestions for whining dogs not barking? That's tough. Um, whining? Whine, like, just Oscar does it a lot. He just does this little chirping sound every now and then, and you tell him to stop. And you tell me that. Like just these little peeping sounds. I, I think bark barking's easier to stop than whining. I don't know if you have any suggestions. Leave it. Yeah. yeah. Knock it off. <laughs> that kind of thing. Yeah. Where did you go today? Uh, same places that I always go: CVS, <laughs> hospital, hotel, uh, Liberty Tree Mall, Stop and Chop. I handed out some calendars to the ladies that work the Dunkin' Donuts in there. They love me. Um, they love the puppies. So. Every year I give her a calendar, and I um, I gave her one today, and it made her day. So. 
what are some of the ramps for in the arena? Um, ramps are just different. I don't know. We just do them for fun. I like the A-frame because the puppies get excited when they run up and down it. I don't know if there's really a, a use for it. I mean, we don't, we're not training agility. It's just... No, but you're teaching, teaching some sort of physical awareness. Yep, where their body is. I mean, you know, it's like a kid that's never learned to ride a bicycle, you know, it's yeah. a problem. It's yeah, we do old. a lot of just fun jumps, keep them stimulated. Um, let's see. I think that's it. It's 5 o'clock, mail time. Everybody's good. Okay. Bye. Bye. Have a good weekend.